I went to church this morning and it was interesting. It always is when you go to a new church because you just kind of, you notice everything about it and you're just like, that's weird, that's cool, that's interesting. And the songs that we sang at the start were pretty much songs I haven't sung in 20 years. It was so bizarre, it was like going in a time warp and I just couldn't figure it out. I was like, why are they singing these songs? Um, have they been singing them since they were new and they just haven't updated their repertoire? If that's the case, is it because they can't afford to? It's like they invested in all these, <laughs> in the sheet music and they're going to get their money's worth. <laughs> or is it that they just don't know that newer songs exist or they can't be bothered learning new ones? Or have they only just discovered these songs and they think they are new? <laughs> you know, any of these possibilities could be the case. Um, the other thing that really amused me today is we had communion and when I have communion at church I don't eat bread because I don't eat gluten. It's um, nothing to do with spiritual aspect of it. But I always wonder what people think because like they probably think that oh I'm from some weird sect. <laughs> yeah I like to keep them guessing. And anyway today when everyone else was having their bread I thought oh Oh, I've got um, food in my bag. I can eat something. So at least I'm eating something while they are. And so I had this green tea and dark chocolate covered blueberry. It was rather good. And it made me think, you know, if I was Jesus and I had to pick a food to represent me for all of eternity, it wouldn't be bread. It'd probably be a green tea and dark chocolate covered blueberry.